A home buying mistake I wish I knew before. Hey, it's Peter Mancini with Penn Realty. So you're thinking about buying your first home, right? Buckle up, because I'm about to give you the no BS advice I wish someone had given me before I jumped into the deep end. The roller coaster ride. Mistakes made and lessons learned. Mistake number one, trying to do everything ourselves. When my partner and I had started, we thought we could handle it all. Scouring online listings, attending open houses, the whole shebang. But honestly, it was exhausting and confusing. We wasted so much time on homes that were either out of our budget or already had dozens of offers. What's the lesson learned? Get a top-notched agent, someone who knows the market inside and out and can guide you every single step of the way. Numero due. Think we needed a 20% down payment. We stressed ourselves out trying to save that magical 20% down payment. It felt like we were never gonna get there, especially with prices rising. You know what? There are plenty of loan options that require much less. Lesson learned, explore all your financing options. Talk to a mortgage broker early on to understand what you can afford what programs are available to you also. I can connect you with one I trust if you need a referral. Tre, failing for the perfect home trap. We found the one and got emotionally attached, but after several bidding wars and heartbreaks, we realized we needed to be a lot more realistic. Lesson learned, stay flexible. Your dream home might not be perfect, but it still can be perfect for you. Focus on the essentials and be willing to compromise on the rest. The emotional roller coaster buying a home is a whirlwind of emotions. You'll feel the excitement of finally owning a place, but you'll also face fear, frustration, and believe me, confusion. You're not alone. If you're scared of making a huge financial mistake, or confused about the complex process. I remember the anxiety of bidding wars and the fear of overpaying for a home that might need, not might, need costly repairs. Those fears constrain your relationship too. We had our share of arguments about budgets, location, dishwasher, and it wasn't pretty. The game, changing mindset shifts. Number one, focus on what you can control. You can't control the market, you can't control the weather, but you can control how prepared you are. Get pre-approved for a mortgage, know your budget, stick to it. This will give you confidence and a competitive edge. Number two, think long-term. Don't get caught up in the frenzy of the current market. Don't get caught up in that frenzy. Think about what you need in your home for the next five to 10 years. Is it a good school district? an extra bedroom, proximity to work, enough space to grow your family. These should be your guiding principles. Three, it's not just about the money. What'd you say? It's not just about the money. Yes, financials are crucial, but so is your peace of mind. Choose a home that feels right emotionally and practically. A place where you can see yourself building memories and a future. Practical steps to win the home buying game. Number one, hire me. Don't settle for your cousin's friend who got his valerian license two days ago. You need someone who's experienced, knows the market, and will fight for you. Two, get fully pre-approved. Not just pre-qualified. This shows sellers you're always serious and ready to go. Three, be ready and go fast. Good homes go quickly. If you see something you love, be prepared to make an offer immediately. Four, do your homework. Go back to school. No, just kidding. Do your homework. Research neighborhoods, schools, and future developments. Spend time in the area to get a feel for it. Number five, prepare for bidding wars. Have a strategy. Know your maximum price. And believe me, stick to it. Sometimes it's worth walking away. You never know. You might get on the back end. Six, Inspect, inspect, inspect. 
never skip the home inspection, even if you're doing a complete gut job. It's worth every penny to know what you're getting into. Here's the bottom line. Buying your first home is a monster deal. It's stressful, emotional, and sometimes downright scary. But it's also incredibly rewarding. The key is to stay informed, be prepared, and keep your eye on the prize, a home that's right for you. If you're ready to take the plunge on the deep end, let's chat. I've been through the ringer and come out the other side, and I'm here to make sure for you too. And here's the best part. I'm gonna make sure you don't have the bumps and the bruises. You ready to find that perfect place? Give me a call or send me an email. Peter Mancini, a signature experience.